Hey, what's up everybody? Danny Lightning here with another CSR2 video. So here's one for the CSR2 how to drive playlist that shows you how to beat dyno time with different cars. Now we got the brand new Rocket Bunny, GTI Rocket Bunny. All right, so I think I have figured out the uh, fastest shift pattern for this car and it's actually really easy and straightforward. So what we're gonna do is let go of the gas right before number one to launch. We're going to do a perfect shift in the second, then we're going to hit our nitrous, perfect in the third, perfect in the fourth. And that should beat the dyno time. So this one's really easy. No early shifts or anything like that, just straightforward. Alright, so here we go. Three, two, let go. Perfect in nitrous, perfect to third, perfect to fourth. And there we should have beaten dyno by about four tenths of a second or something like that. I might even strip one of my other GTIs to uh, put parts into this. So we got 10.438 and the dyno time is 10.801. So that's like three and a half seconds or something we're beating it by. Not seconds, tenths of a second. So let's do that again. Three and a half tenths of a second. I'm not very good at my math. <laughs> All right, here we go. Three, two, let go. Perfect in nitrous. Third, perfect in the fourth. And let's see what we run. Ten point four two three. So usually I run a 10.42 or a 10.43, all right? And as you saw, the dyno time was 10.801. So that's how you beat dyno time with this car. Let's do it one more time. But no matter what I've tried so far, this is the best I can do. A lot of these cars you'll have early skip shifts or you'll skip a gear or something like that, but not on this one. I have a feeling this is going to be a really nice live racing car. Three, two, let go. Perfect nitrous, perfect, and perfect. So far I've got one stage six part in this and quite a few fusions. And for a tier two car, the evil points are already pretty high. Especially when there's a lot more, uh, there's a lot more I'm going to be able to put into this. So 10.428 on that one. But yeah, they're already at plus 581. And I still got a ways to go before this thing's maxed out. But anyways, that's how you uh, beat dyno time with this car. So hope this helps. If you like my videos, please hit the like button and subscribe. Alright, thanks.